RTA 10, Station for Excellence. Lagos Channel 10 News at 7. I am Stella Eyudo. Nigerians have been encouraged to shun corruption, ethnicism, and bigotry for a sustainable development of the nation. This was the take of the President's Penel Care Foundation, Dr. Gladys Nwankwo, at an event themed the Day of National Rebranding. Adobe Obichina tells us more. The event had over 500 widows and children come together to celebrate Nigeria's 50. With the theme, Today for National Rebranding, speakers called on government at all levels, as well as all Nigerians, to contribute their quota in making Nigeria a better country. They also called on families to unite as a small unit of the society to ensure love, respect and affection among them for peace, individual well-being and growth. My prayer is that they'll be able to release their children at least over the weekends by a Sunday school club, Saturday clubs. That's what we tend to do, whereby we'll have our boss and do something we've done today and gather all these children together, give them weekly moral instruction. Rebranding Nigeria initiatives, especially as they relate to the growth and development of the society, is quite the main. To them outside, so it's still with us. And at the same time, we must be able to, as we're leading them, as we're showing them love, we must set limits. We must let them know that some things are not doable, some things are doable. We must encourage them. We must be able to praise them. We must be able to encourage them, tell them they are doing well. Whatever they have shortcomings, we correct them with love. Look for what you can do to add to the development of your country. We encourage people to be productive. We want people to relate positively with their neighbors beginning with the members of their household. We encourage people to contribute their own quota to um, community development. We encourage people to love one another. Some attendees spoke on the essence of the gathering. So today we are here again to see and to help other less privileged and their widows. I've learned a lot of change. That we that will move my life forward. The event had this competition and poem citation by the youth and cutting of the cake. Nigeria is diverse. With over 250 ethnic groups, we need to be united to move this country forward. <laughs> Food items were also distributed to cushion the hardship caused by COVID-19. Pinet Care Foundation was established in 2011 to cater for the need of widows, youth, children, and the poor. Its core value is to teach moral to society. In Lagos, Adobe Obiechina, NTA News. <laughs> 